Hey everyone, Vickerman here. This is Antharian. And we're in the sewers. Looking for the butcher. Uh, I suppose... Yeah, I don't, don't know where I've not been yet. I've been there. I've been there too. Where are you, butcher? We're up to semi-competent fighting form now. There we go. This seems promising. That doesn't seem that promising, though. Ah. Hello. Oh! This must be it. Well, hello. We've got some human flesh here. You must be the butcher. Now, what is this? If you come all the way down here just for me? Oh, are you now? Haha, uh -huh, that's a good one. I'm going to assume that Administrator Tone can put you up to this. Only a bumbling idiot of his sort would think to send the four of you down here to confront me. Now that you're here, I'm going to give you a choice. One, you can try your hand at slaying me and my undead henchmen. Good luck with that. Two, you can help me take care of this fool Tonkin. Your power of persuasion is lacking. Trying to get away here.
thinking maybe these guys might be out of the mana for some of this stuff. Maybe I should come back. Butcher is dead. Coming for you guys. Whoa, get back. Aha! Okay, so we've got a good number of them killed. So, I think if we rest... Hoping they don't re respawn or anything. Now, uh, part of the reason I was a little afraid there is this game does not have an autosave. Be very careful. I was not very careful there. Getting into that fight. Okay, not too bad. Oh, I got an ear, a minotaur horn. Oh, the minotaur horn is an ingredient. Uh, the butcher, did you have anything on your cold dad's corpse? Identify, unidentified item. I think we give it to you. Requires a lore of 40. Holy cow, man. Can we buy identification in town somewhere? Okay, we've killed the butcher. Let's go get our reward. If I can remember the way out of here. I think it's this way. Goes to show, don't eat undercooked orc meat.
Is it over here? Here we go. Let's go see Tonkin. Hey man, he tried to get me to kill you. Thanks you. Hey, new level up. Little bit of uh, HP. All right, eh? So 591 gold now. And uh, some stuff we can sell too. Now, do you identify stuff? All right. What do we got? Berserker rags. Armor 3, strength plus 5. Is that regular army? Or armor? Okay, requires level 5. Okay. Yeah, I don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Six eleven plus four wisdom. Well, I do think that maybe this is the way to go. Hold up. Let's check the level. Choir's level 2. Very good. And that's really all that we can afford. Look kind of funny in them sandals, man. Okay, is there like a general store somewhere here. I think maybe the inn is technically the general store. Whoopsie. Illumination. You've got some arrows too. Bananas. Yeah, lockpicks. Let's get like 10. We got enough for that. Five. Not enough for that. Three. Sure. Okay, let's. Let's see if we can get into this thing now. If 
47% chance. Okay, so I guess what we gotta do now is hunt some crabs. Maybe there's some here on the beach. Oh, what's this? Why, hello there. Just the usual moaning of the rebel. I'll tell you all Anthurianites ever do is complain and groan about how bad everything is. So what if Shadowbrook was destroyed? That's a little callous of you. And what concern of mine is it if we were to be raided by Orcish Bandits at some future time? The past is gone and the future has yet to be unfolded. All we have at this moment is right here, right now. Anything else is either wishes or regrets. Many of my friends do tell me that, but really I think of myself more as a traveling bard type. Uh, what, what aren't I doing? I'm a writer, painter, and lover of nature. I've come here to escape the cold of my homeland. I've found that the fresh ocean air offers a kind of spiritual nourishment. Yes, and to finish a novel I've been working on. It is of the fantasy genre. It's about a young elven woman coming of age in the northern part of the fictional Antargrian Empire. She lives among bunches of xenophobic wolfkin who do nothing but tease and taunt her all year round. Eventually, though, she summons up courage to, oh really, I must stop myself before I bore you with all the details. What will you do with it once it's finished? Well, I really shouldn't say anything, but the other day I went to see Vincent at Vincent Books, expressed an interest in stalking our no my novel once it's completed. While well, I have certain, shall we say, reservations about seeing my work next to the likes of the drivel on his shelves, I think that having a single big commercial success would, in the end, allow me to indulge in more of the high-minded literary style that comes so naturally to me. Oh, very good. Carry on, then. There's a boat here. Not mine. That must be the boat you can buy. Eh, nothing there. Those crabs won't know what hit them, let me tell you. Now that we're all stronger. Well, we ought to save just in case. You never know how crabby the crabs can be. Hey, hello, seagull. Piece of cake. We got some lizards here. Wait. What is attacking me? Is it the lizards or? Quite a force of lizards. Ah, oh, they went right for the mage. You'd like taunt or something to do proper tanking. You missed, man.
Mist. Mist. Whee. I wonder if I'm too far away. I haven't really been paying attention to success chance. Collect this plan here? No. How about this one? No. Probably better rest for like an hour. Maybe another. Get that mana up. Or whatever they call it, spell points. Lots of lizards over here. They're actually quite terrifying. Much like seals and crabs once were. Bit of mana here. Which I suppose you should. Probably a mistake to use that, but. Oh man, we're in the middle of a desert here. Hello there. I study the artifacts left by the ancients. Margzon is a rich treasure trove of lost artifacts buried beneath the sand dunes. Used to work with Markov and Stradenhold, but we didn't exactly see eye to eye on things. While I may be interested in power artifacts, those artifacts known to imbue the user with special powers, Markov seemed only interested in advancing the historical record, a mere clerical task, if you ask me. Well, I was, but I have all but given up, I'm afraid. For years I've been in search of a statuette called the Golden Miniex. It was broken in two pieces during the orc invasion of Margzon, and I've managed to track down the locations of both pieces. The only problem is each piece is buried in runes that are believed to be crawling with some of the most heinous creatures one can imagine. I am but an older scholar and have little business rummaging around in such a place. Hmm, yes, I think you could. You all appear to be in good physical conditions. I'm sure you could uh, manage your way through a ruin or two. The first fragment is buried in the Balsung ruins east of here. Take the path towards the dock and make your first left it'll be right there second fragment is located in the Agnan ruins to get there take the main road towards Stradenhold after going through the mountain pass make a left and it's right there when you have possession of both fragments bring them back here to me I shall attempt to piece them back together I don't know that we're supposed to be here just yet uh, Take this man's apple and skedaddle. Now let's try to go back the way we came. Uh, 
So maybe we ought to go and do that quest that the rogue guy sent us on now, because I think, well, maybe we're strong enough for that. We'll just have to see, but I think that's probably what the next move needs to be. Especially since I can't find any crab. I think we'll probably run into crab along the way. Oh, I bet he's just going home. Yeah, they do have schedules, you know. Alright, crab. mug this crab. Oh, come on. Come on, man. Youch. Crab meat. Lizard tail. That's not what I was expecting from a crab. You only need three more pieces of crab meat, man. So, yeah. We will do that next time. There's more crabs to kill and ruins to explore. Or something like that. I can't remember what the main quest is. Yeah, we gotta find a codex. So, we'll probably be on our way to doing that in the next episode. See you then.